Hello again. The weather is going to remain fairly changeable all the way through the rest of this week and even into Christmas Day. We're looking at rain at times. It's also going to become very windy, especially so on Thursday. And there's the chance of snow for some. A lot of that will be on the hills in the north. Now you can see the cooler blues today, but then we've got the milder yellows and ambers during the course of Wednesday and Thursday. But on Thursday and Friday, some colder air tries to push in from the north, but the milder air wins out from the south for many of us as we head in towards the weekend. But into this afternoon, we've got the dregs of this morning's rain continuing to pull away from the south and the east. A lot of dry weather behind, a fair bit of sunshine, but all these showers coming in on the brisk winds across the north and the west. The strongest winds will be in the north and west, but it will be picking up across the southwestern approaches and also the English Channel. Now, temperatures will go down following on behind that band of rain. And as we head on through the evening and overnight, there will be some clear skies for a time. We hang on to all these showers in the west. The wind's going to strengthen. And then a weather front, a warm front, arrives. Temperatures three in Larwick to about nine in Plymouth. Now that warm front is quite salient because this means the temperature is going to change through the course of tomorrow. So there is the front moving from the west to the east, taking the rain with it. Behind it, there's a lot of cloud, low cloud, mist marked, dank conditions, especially in western areas on the hills and the coasts. Out towards the southeast, something a bit drier, but the cloud building through the course of the day. And these are our temperatures, widely 11s and 12s. So milder air following on behind the warm front. But then it changes on Thursday. This potent area of low pressure is crossing us. Look at all those isobars. It's going to be windy wherever you are. The strongest winds likely to be in the north of Scotland, particularly Shetland. Here we could have gusts 70 or 80 miles an hour, but widely 50 to 60 miles an hour. So a windy day. We've also got a plethora of showers. Most of them will be of rain. In the highlands, there'll be of sleet and snow in the hills, but that will come down to lower levels for a time. And you can see the colder air trying to filter further south, but the south itself hanging on to the milder conditions. Looks like it's still going to be pretty windy, but not as on Friday. And temperatures going down in the north, and the jury's still out for Christmas Day. Could be some snow, though, in the hills in the north.